We're here with Concordia right fielder and 2011 GSAT Gold Glover Ryan Sheets, and we're on the verge of the first pitch of the Avista NAI World Series. Ryan, you had a great first season as an Eagle last year. You hit 315, six doubles, and 27 runs. But still, the way last season ended uh, wasn't exactly what you would have uh, hoped for on a personal note uh, after you're hitting the face with a pitch in the, the last regular season game. What was it like uh, rehabbing from that injury, and, and what was the hardest part of getting back in the batter's box for you? Well, um, rehabbing was just time. Just had to wait for it to heal up. Um, and I spent a lot of the time trying to figure out, okay, I can I can step in the box and take a pitch up and in and be okay with it and and not, you know, be unable to step back in the box after that pitch. So it was one of those things where I just had to start seeing pitches, start getting more at bats, and and I got in the groove. And summer ball helped out with that a lot. Hmm. Uh, both you and Kyle Konachek uh, were returning starters on the outfield, but neither one of you were were everyday starters towards the beginning of the season. Tell me about the the journey that you had. And uh, how you've just grown through through that experience this year? Oh, it's a great experience. It's uh, it, it taught Kyle and I both of us to learn that you know um, we're a team, you know, and we're gonna win as a team, or we're gonna be a team the whole time. And just because him and I weren't out there because we were out there last year doesn't mean you know it's a bad thing. It means that you know we're we're out there working hard together. Uh, um, I don't know if you know this or not, but that Homer that you hit against Biola in the GSAC postseason tournament uh, championship game was the team's first homer in 573 at-bats. Uh, but even so, you guys went 1-15 out of 17 games during that span, uh, including the 12-game winning streak. What does that say about the way uh, this team is put together for you guys to go on that, that well, streak? Coaches were really uh, pressed that we, you know, we're not... You're not, we're not the bomber team that a lot of teams are in our conference, and we're the team that's going to grind people out. We're going to, you know, lay down bunts. We're going to sacrifice. We're going to, you know, get that timely hit and, and steal bases, and, and it's a team effort, and, and that's what we believed in all year. One last question for you, Ryan. What are your plans now uh, with, with college kind of getting in the rearview mirror for you? Um, I'd like to finish up school. Uh, graduated next year and uh, probably go on and, and coach and, and train other athletes and, and make other ball players out of, uh, out of my efforts. All right, Ryan. Well, thanks so much for your time, and uh, we'll see you up there in Lewiston. Thank you.